So I went and bought a brand new 2021 a brand new 2021 if you know me you know i'm lying so this is a 04 nissan maxima <laughs> um pretty good car you could say it got the moon roof not the sun roof so this shit doesn't it doesn't move but it just slides back and forth and it's two of them this doesn't work but if it did that'd have been awesome but at least tells you where you're going so it'll tell you north south west where the hell um what else we got here oh yeah we got seat warmers which is awesome. The AC again doesn't work, so we gotta figure that out. We got steering wheel warmer, which is amazing. Uh, those are all of your mirror controls, and then that's where the trunk button and the gas button is. Then I also got a, you also got torn leather seats and some real wear and tear here. Can you see that? Yeah. So, gotta figure out how to get rid of that. Um, the back seats aren't as bad. I tell nobody said in the back seats, but the front seats are, yeah. Trying to debate if I want to paint them or just clean them up. Because the thing is, if it got heated, if it's heated leather seats, I don't want the paint to come off. So that's something to keep in mind. So this model actually is the SL. So it's the top model for this year. So overall, I mean, it's not, it's not too uh, a bad car. It'll be a great first car for someone or somebody who just needs a daily driver. It'll probably be perfect for the winter because everything will be nice and hot. But as far as the summer, ooh. Mm. Especially without the AC working. Mm. Now, because it's super hot, the AC might not work. But we're gonna try to charge it and just see what happens. Because then maybe, just maybe, maybe it just needs a recharge. But usually, the AC just never, ever just needs a recharge. Do not get fooled with that. If somebody tells you that when they're about to sell you a car, tell them to put the AC in. It's only about 30 bucks, 40 bucks. If it only needs a recharge, tell them to do it and then see what happens. And don't let them charge jacket parts up, but you buy $200. It ain't worth it. Legit. Now, the issue, A, again, the AC doesn't work. The big issue is that it's smoking. Gotta figure out why is it smoking and how to alleviate that. So, again, we always start the smallest things. You start your liquids, you look for leaks, and then you go from there. Now, Interesting enough, the, the exhaust system has been replaced. And this car only has 94,000 miles on it. So right now, I could sell it for at least 2,700. I only paid 19 for it. <clears throat> but, because honestly, the car uh, is actually worth about 34. And if I kind of restore it, it can go back up to 44. So we're gonna keep that in mind. So this car is gonna be a little project. Unless somebody wanted it today. And you might or you might not get it. <laughs> All right, so again, outside, 2004 Nissan Maxima we got some body damage right there we have some rust spots down there <clears throat> we got brand new brakes though and brand new tires that's awesome so we have to definitely get rid of this and we have some fading at the top of the trunk let's see what else we got here another rust spot down there and we gotta clean the door up a little bit and we got some scratches and stuff around the front. And of course the hood has fading as well. But took the cover off so we could see, you see it? Yeah, it's oil around our ignition coils. That's something to look for. And you're not gonna be able to see down there. But we also got some oil or some sludge towards the bottom on our oil filter. So we gotta see where that's coming from. But yeah, so I went and bought another car. You can see the front of it, the top's up. But it's actually pretty cool just because I, I got it for a cheap price. But it's gonna be a project, it's gonna be a project. <laughs>